A new study shows mental health care can be harder to access in Kansas compared to other states. Mental Health America ranked the Sunflower State at 22. Last year, Kansas came in last. Zena Taher reports. Kansas did rank higher this year than last year. MHA says the two studies aren't comparable, though, because methodology has changed this past year, which could have been why results changed so dramatically. It still doesn't change the fact mental health care can be hard to come by for people in certain parts of the state. According to Mental Health America, mental health care can be harder to come by in parts of Kansas. West of Hutch, there's not going to be a whole lot. That includes in places like Great Bend. I asked him, I said, you know, if there's something that you don't have here that you need, so what's the next largest population area that you have to go to? And they said Wichita. Eric Litweiler with Mental Health America of South Central Kansas says that two hour difference isn't close enough to be adequate. So that's pathetic but it's what they have access to. And, and so that's certainly a big part of, of the issue in mental health too. Rural Minds, an organization that helps supplement mental health care in rural communities, says in general, there are less mental health professionals in rural areas. People who live in rural areas tend to be very self-sufficient. That's part of the reason, you know, that people take up professions such as ranching or farming is because they are very independent and they like to work on their own. But unfortunately, hand in glove with that goes the fact that they also are more reticent to ask for help. Julie Lux with Rural Minds says a lot of the help for people in areas with less mental health care access comes from family and friends taking notice. She says the best thing to do is listen to someone's problems if they're having mental health struggles, then encourage them to talk to a professional or clergy member. More resources are available on the Rural Minds website. We'll have that linked in our article on KSN.com. Here for you, Zena Taher, KSN News 3.